guys, welcome back. So, um, today I'm going to be doing an updated about what is in my handbag video. And um, this is my gorgeous Louis Vuitton Bria GM. If you'd like to see what's in my bag, then just keep on watching. Okay, before I start, ladies, I just wanted to put a disclaimer out there again. In no ways or means am I bragging in anything that I do. You guys have already seen this a bag in another video, but that was the Bria MM, but I got it changed for the Bria GM because I didn't know they had a GM size, so I just wanted to go for something that was a lot bigger. So yeah, I just wanted to put that across. And also, uh, the last video that I did of the Louis Vuitton... Um, uh, port of the Louis Vuitton Belmont bag. I just want to say as well, all that you guys left all messages down below about the authenticity card. I know that Louis Vuitton bags do not come with authenticity cards. I did not know that when I first um, came across Louis Vuitton. I didn't know what designer bags were like then. I'm just going to give you my truth opinion because I love you guys so much. I'm just going to tell you the exact truth right down to the point. I seriously did not know what bags came with and I got that from somebody over like abroad. Um, somebody, one of my members went to, uh, one of my relatives went to New York and they just bought that for me and that's what it came in. But I did actually take it into the Louis Vuitton store and they said to me that the card shouldn't be in there but it is real so yeah I just wanted to clear that with you guys the bag is authentic 110% but it is just the card that they said just throw away and what they did then they obviously got a dust bag with it then they just packed it away in with the box in there and everything and just gave me a little booklet to go with it so it is 110% authentic so I just wanted to put that across to you guys and mention that as well just to clear some questions that I did get asked a lot so yeah enough of my rambling onto my beautiful bags this is the Bria uh, GM and I have to come out the camera because it's so huge but it's in this gorgeous um, pink pinky like pinky what colour shall I say um, it's like a really gorgeous light pinky glittery colour so it's really beautiful it comes with the strap on there like that and it's adjustable so you can just adjust it to any size that you would like and then it comes with the two hand straps that you can just put onto your shoulder and then just hold it like that but the thing I love about this bag is that when I do have it on my shoulder, because there is one strap on the back and then one strap on the front, if you can see that, I'm able to clearly, like if I've got it around me, I'm just able to kind of open the bag and just get what I need to get out of there and then just put the straps down and then just hold the bag and I'm good to go so I don't have to like move the straps away. So one is on that side and one is on that side. So that's the thing I love, love, love about this bag. Um, this bag is on the pricey, pricey, pricey side. Um, the reason why I brought it is just that I wanted something a bit different. Um, so I just thought it'd be something nice to get. So yeah, let's just get right into it and show you what is in here. It's super heavy at the moment, so just kind of just weighing it down. It's just so heavy, this bag is, but it's just so well worth it. I'll explain everything that is on the bag after the video when it's empty because it's super heavy so yeah let's just get right into it okay to start off with on the um, top I have my DKNY bag and um, this is what I got from the House of Fraser in a pack of three and in here I just have some receipts my checkbook and some brushes Two Face brushes um, it's just an eye one, an angle one and a shader one so that's something that I just picked up from Sephora also I've got this gorgeous kit that I got from Deb Debnums, yeah that's it, it was Debnums and inside there they just have um, all your nail essentials in there so I've just got um, some scissors, two nail clippers, some tweezers nail filers, nail filer and just a cuticle pusher and the thing that I just, the reason why I bought this was because of the case 
but the case is so gorgeous so I've got that right in there so if anyone needs on me for nail emergencies and then I've got this Nivea I love this got a little butterfly and I've got this Nivea little pouch um, I bought this and I just got some like lotion and stuff in there like that and just some eardrops and some hand cream hand sanitizer and separate cards as well I just put into there I do not know why I've got this in here but this is the Malibon GM Demia label <laughs> so I did buy one of them so I do not know why the hell that isn't there but actually I think I found this in the car and then I just kind of shoved it into my bag because I don't want to lose this just in case so yeah I've just got that in there then I've just got this front cover gorgeous um, like pencil casey thing and I've just got a couple of painkillers and eye drops and tablets in there just to kind of help with like allergies what I get with my eyes and stuff like that and just some painkillers like paracetamol, ibuprofen and all that so just keep that in there okay I've then got my agenda which has ripped <laughs> I'm so annoyed but this is the agenda that I use um, for all my um, client bookings all my appointments that I have with clients for the hair and beauty business and all that stuff so that's the stuff that I keep in here and sometimes just end up writing some uni stuff in here as well so this has a nice note section at the back where I do put um, a couple of my uni bits and bobs so yeah I've got that diary in there but I need to order a new one from Vistaprint um, with a new cover on it so I'm just going to get that ordered as well okay then I've got this gorgeous gorgeous thing again from Claire's and it's so beautiful and it's again the same thing like before but this one is just so cute and this again has got um, a nail filer, a tweezer, a cuticle pusher, a little spatula, a nail clipper and then some scissors that is super cute love fuchsia interior I think it is just so adorable do you ladies ever have problems with bobby pins because my bag usually when I empty it out it's just full of bobby pins and it drives me flipping bananas so I got these things from Claire's I think they were yeah two pounds and what they are is they're just little um, things that you open and then you can just put your Kirby grips in there just to keep them safe so I've just got two of them in my bag because I'm forever losing Kirby grips I do not know where the hell they go I buy packs and packs and packs and boxes of them and I do not know where they just disappear and so I just like to keep refilling that as well all the time and then I've got my tablet in there that I always keep with me tablet with me and it's gorgeous pink cover on there so this is the Samsung Galaxy Tab 3 the new one that has come out so yeah I just keep that with me on the go doing bits and bobs that I need to do but I've already got the 10.1 inch Tab 2 as well but just keep this as just convenient and easy just to throw in my bag and use it when I'm on the go Then I've just got a couple of pens, of my company pens, you can see um, Karen Beauty on there. And I've just got a pen from MAC, I got when I did the course, so yeah, I've just got a couple of pens in there. And that is in the compartment. And that is in these two compartments here. Okay, and then I've got my current favourite lipstick that I've been loving, loving, loving and wearing every single day. And this is the Rouge Volant uh, YSR lipstick in the number 29. So that is such a gorgeous colour. That is my everyday lipstick that I wear all the time. So I just leave that in that compartment. Instead of putting it into my Louis Vuitton cosmetic pouch, it's easy just to grab and apply. And yeah, these last for ages as well. And then I've got a gorgeous mirror that I got from Claire's I think it is well just a double mirror so yeah I've just got that in there okay 
Just have some change of money just stuffed in there. And some more money and change stuffed in the little compartments. I'm so bad I am, I just have money thrown everywhere. And I've just got my House of Fraser recognition card. Um, just my MK Hair and Beauty uh, business card holder. So cute, but my sister got me this. I do not know where from, but it's just a little notebook with a ribbon on there that just like clips open, and it's just I just throw loads of like notes and stuff in. It. If I just want to jot anything down or remember anything, because I'm so clueless sometimes, I like just have that in there. It's just convenient because it's just super small. And I have my perfume refiller bottle. This is the Hugo Boss perfume refiller, so you just literally turn it up like that. And it hasn't got Hugo Boss in there. I just love this one compared to the bullet one that you get just because I just find that it holds better, it's more convenient and it's less, less I find than the other one sometimes the other one starts leaking so yeah I just mix, I just put any um, perfumes in this at any time. At the moment I've got the Chanel number no. 5, I forgot what the name is, perfume in there at the moment so yeah, got that in there. And then in the zippy bit over here, just got the um, tag for it. So it's the Bria GM uh, Row Angel Colour M90067. And I've got the booklet that it comes with. So it's the Monogram Vernis. And this little tag thing. So. Yeah, I just keep that into the zip compartment. The wallet is, so it's a zippy coin purse, and it's one canvas that just goes all the way around. And it's in the gold tone hardware, and it's just got a compartment in there. And then the card slots, just got some cash. Um, a zippy thing here for coins, and then another compartment, just a little secret compartment in there. Some more card slots, and then another compartment in there so this purse is just super stuffed with change so I do need to invest into a coin purse but I'm going to be changing my purse from this zippy wallet to the Louis Vuitton Multicolor Insulate Wallet so if you want to see a video on that then leave a comment down below but yeah I'm going to be changing this wallet because I'm getting bored of it now <laughs> I know it sounds silly I'm just getting bored of it now okay I'm going to have my phone and it's just got the Samsung Galaxy S4. My cover did break on this phone so I'm just ordered another one. I'm just waiting for that to come through. And then last but not least is my Louis Vuitton cosmetic pouch in the multicolour um, monogram and in here I just have some bits and bobs in there as well. So if you ladies would like to see um, the contents of what I've got in my makeup pouch or what kind of makeup stuff I take away with me then just leave a comment below and I shall show you what's in my Louis Vuitton cosmetic pouch. So yeah that is the, <laughs> emptied my whole bag, just feels so much lighter now and spent a fortune on this bag. I wanted something that had feet on it but the tags have finally fallen off the bottom bit so... Yeah, it just says Louis Vuitton, if you can see, on the little feet, right there, and then just got it on these stud bits here, and um, it's already started to um, patina as well, so the colour has started to change, it just says Louis Vuitton, literally all over the purse, so here on these little bits here and I've left the tag on on that bit yet and then it just says Louis Vuitton uh, made in France so I've lucky I got a France piece and it's really huge inside this compartment here and then the bag as you can see is mega huge with these two pocket bits there And then I love the thing that Solomon's bag as well is that it's kind of like a little 
like a little charm as well, the way the closure of the bag is. Um, so it's got this big Louis Vuitton zipper thing, so I love it. And this is in the gold tone hardware, so if you zip the bag up then this is what it looks like. And then it just curves in nicely on the ends. As you can see, everything just fits in here nice and snug. So everything just kind of lines up in the bag. So yeah, I hope you have enjoyed what's in my bag slash handbag, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. Um, video of my Louis Vuitton Bria GM and please don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and also subscribe I would really appreciate it because it means so much to me I'll see you guys on my next video thank you so much for watching take care bye